Hey, 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 what do you know? The kid is back. Actually, I'm not a kid, so I don't know. Anyways, your boy's here, WilkieBoy8, streaming, hosting Call of Duty, Sagu, Modern Warfare 2, Purple Team against King University tonight. Um, both teams are in a must-win playoff situation. Let's look at the bracket here. Right now, King University uh, is sitting with... Oh, hold on. Give me one second. Ah! Nope. Nope. There we go. All right. King University. Let's find these guys. They have to play two matches tonight. They're sitting three and two. So they're in an advantage. They have an extra game that they can lose, but they do have a lot of matches that they need to play. So King University having three points, needing to just get their fourth to make playoffs with another match after this. What is up, Lidge? It's good to see you again. And then we also have uh, Sagu Purple with one more win that's necessary for their playoff run. Um so it's exciting. It should be exciting. Um, King University's most recent matches uh, for Modern Warfare 2 have been a 1-3 loss against St. Andrews, two forfeit wins over Buff State and uh, University of Albany's B team, uh, another forfeit win over CSC Cod White. So and and they've lost 3-0 against Mel Mel Meladial Mavericks. Um, right now it's kind of looking like. King University has been carried to to the playoffs. Okay, you're all good, Lidge. You can hang out here as long as you want. Just come back and say hi so I know I'm not scared and alone. But uh, I don't know. It doesn't seem doesn't seem like King is going to be in a position to where they can really win this. They haven't really been tested in matches that they can win. Um, again, they did have the 3-1 loss to St. Andrews. St. Andrews so far having a pretty okay record. Looks like they're 5-2, so it's not you know that, that bad of a loss. But, um, yeah, so King University really not being tested against a team that may or may not be won or lost. So uh, it's exciting to see. This is a matchup that hopefully should go well. We're just waiting on them to join the lobby right now. And uh, once they do, everything will be um, happy hunky-dory, as the kids say. So, uh, yeah, as for now, we're just chilling out. So if you guys in the chat have any questions for me, let me know. We will see what we can answer and, and get rolling on uh, for you guys. So, yeah, just let me know. We're still, we are still just waiting. Waiting, waiting, waiting. Probably should put oh 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 my goodness everyone just joined. Way to go! All right, so we will be rolling here. Make sure that looks right. I think it does. Bop, bop, pow. Oh, hold on. HTTPS. There we go. All right. All right, all right, all right. So we are waiting on the teams. I think we're ready to go here. Teams have been set. We're at Codcaster. Um, probably should share the stream in the ECAC uh, channel so these people don't think that we're weird or crazy. Um, bop, pow, boom, skiddity scow. All right, we're good. Okay, and we are just waiting on them to start it up. All right, match is starting. We are rolling and ready to go. I'm excited. You guys might be excited too. 
I know Call of Duty is playing on two different streams tonight, but um, here I am, and we are chilling right now, so all is good, to me at least. Alright, so Sagu Purple playing Call of Duty Hardpoint. Um, right now... Country getting an excellent pick off the middle. And... Looks like they're trying to play to get spawns for the second point while holding currently. It doesn't look like anyone's making a big push on the objectives. Skipper here, still trying to hold P2, getting ready for extra points to be grabbed. Looks like I Am Man is going to be trying to flank around, flanking with Naked. Doesn't look like he's getting anything. Skipper having three people on him. God's looking like he's making a push on his own. Looks like they're looking right at where he's going. He's just trying to get in there, see if he can get something. Country trying to make a push, doesn't see Iron Man sitting in the back corner. So far right now, Sagu does have the lead, but it is a little scary. Oh, nice pick by Country, he's reloading though. Not lacking. Gods dies, looks like Kenny Pineapple Fanta is coming up here. Trying to make a push on his own. Doesn't see him behind the car. And he gets dropped there. Sagu not winning a lot of 1v1s here. Uh, Jaden is able to get one. Skip trying to get some nades in there, but they have a trophy system. And it's just gunfight after gunfight after gunfight being lost. Country's still able to get some picks. Actually, he's getting some of the kills here for the team. And it looks like right here is where you want to go ahead and switch off to the next point. Good to see you, Sticks. Thank you for tuning in to the stream. Um, Gods is really trying to just move on to the next area here. We're going to go on to holding points. We have Skipper, Pineapple, shots, watching the back door. Country out of ammo, needs to reload, gets shot from kitchen. Keep Mercy trying to make a push or shoots through the... Everything. Goodness. Everything can be shot through these days. God's trying to make a push. It's one. Looks to get two. Not there. And he gets shot, taken down. Country making a push, he gets shot down. Keep trying to hold back, killing it hot tub. And he's going to try to move into actual point here and see if he can stall or freak someone out. But he's going to get swarmed by the other team. Drops one. The rest of the team pushing in. We get another one. Jaden gets two. This is a whole wipe for the team. They are already taking this point. Going to salvage what they can here. But you're going to see that they're going to start rotating right here. Esteban moves, but he's getting dropped. Um, Country trying to hold, but he can't really see. Jaden is. Ends up getting killed by him. Kenny picks it up, and we have Jaden pushing on the next point here on P4. Oh, there's someone right above Esteban. And he's not able to see, doesn't know. And P4 desk is already dead, so he's looking in a bad spot. God's holding down a position here. Picked up an AK off of... Uh, of his body. Esteban, living by the skin of his teeth, able to somehow get away from all these things. Country not seeing what's behind him. Putting trust in his teammates to kill everyone. Finally sees the body. Country finally getting taken off the P4 desk. Man, lo really looks like King University is making an okay push on this. And they've just wiped the entire team. That's okay though, you got 20 seconds on this. Start rotating for the next point. That is where we are looking for this match to go. Looks like God's trying to see if he can get any extra picks off. Not going to get anything just yet. Skipper getting flanked on each side. Trent finally able to get a clutch. He's able to get him down and, and start regaining those points for Sagu. Purple team is not winning so far, but it looks like they have control of this point fairly well. Starting to try to clear out. It looks like... Hots gets another kill here. 
any laying down. Dropping one, drops two, gets the assist. There's one more coming in from Carpet, but they don't see him. They don't know he's there, so right now they're just trying to hold and keep anyone from that was trying to get in to get out. Looks like Esteban moving for an early rotation here. While Kenny is still holding point. He doesn't get one. Doc's trying to pick up the rest. He ends up dying. We already have movement on the next point. Kenny getting the guy on back stairs. Excellent movement by him. Making sure that he's rotating early and getting all these kills. And it really looks like Gods is getting all the kills for Sagu right now. Uh, 22 and 10. You got Kenny with 8 and 10. Country and Skipper both 6 kills. And it uh, looks like an uneven distribution. But if it's working, it's working. And if it's working, you just got to let it work. Country trying to hold this angle right here. See if anyone's coming in. Skipper gets it killed. Oh, the same angle. Country gets one. He reloads. He's not ready for the second one. Sometimes you just have to hold that mag instead of just firing as soon as you can. Oh, Kenny gets one. He's throwing an eight. He's trying to get them all. There's just one person on left on point. They go ahead. They're able to clean this up. That's going to be a good extra set of points, and that should bring the tie back up for Sagu. Excellent job to hold the rest of these points, but it doesn't look like Sagu's getting that much of an early go. Country trying to hold down an angle, but sees Kappa behind the box. He's not able to kill him. Gets stunned. He's looking in the wrong direction. Doesn't know what he's going to be able to do here. Skipper gets behind Lamar desk. He's able to actually hold this at a better angle for most of his team as they come back in. We got them coming in from the top. Oh, watch out right there. Nobody helped him out. Esteban died because nobody was looking for his teammates, or nobody on his team was looking for him. Got Country still holding a contesting point, doing an excellent job staying alive. Gets another kill. He has been playing well today and getting kills when he needs to. Whether he's caught out of position or not, he's doing very excellent in all that he's striving to do. He's getting flanked right here, not able to get a move. Kenny trying to come up through carpet. Doesn't know that someone is at McDonald's. He just runs right by him. Kenny ends up picking it up anyways. You have Esteban. He's already at the early rotation here waiting for King University to start pushing him. But they're coming in from three different angles. This is real scary if you're the guy that has to get shot in the back and get one. And that's exactly what happened. Country trying to pick it up. Doesn't know. He's looking, 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 looking. Can't see. And he's just behind the box where he was. Jaden drops one here in the back trying to go ahead and make a push to move up. But he's not able to see it just yet. And the Vaz just doesn't beat up the scar in the long run. Country gets one with his AK moving in, trying to see if he can get another one. Gets two. Uh, Skipper's got the final kill on that. Kenny got the excellent assist. Looking for the middle. Doesn't see anyone. Can't get the shot off. It's a very stressful spot to be in, but he's doing very well. All these reloads. Oh, and he just can't kill everyone. Again, you have Skipper making the early rotation. Excellent job by Sega to recognize that, hey, you know, this may not be worth fighting that hard over. Red just missing the last shot. Can you see if he can pick it up? This guy has super armor. Gets one. Ends up dropping. Jaden cleans it up and is holding the point. Getting those extra ticks on the board for second. Gets one more. Looking at the other corner. He was the last guy. So we're going to go ahead and shift off of P2. Moving on to P3 now. Country caught lacking, but Esteban ends up picking it up and clearing out for him. And it looks like he's going to start going on the hunt here. Just start keeping him on the point. And uh, he ends up losing. This means that the next encounter is going to be right here. Country's going to have to look at Chris. Make sure he gets this guy. It's an excellent job by him. We also got a kill at Kitchen Door. Kenny drops. We got one kill. Skipper trying to hold this angle. Make sure that he's okay. Wait for him to come in. Oh, he went around. He went around the back side. He doesn't see. He doesn't see him. He doesn't see him at all. Country gets another one. Country holding down point. Excellent job and performance by him so far tonight. Sagu really wants this playoff win. They want it so bad. You can tell by how they're playing. Kenny wants it so bad he's willing to kill anyone he needs his own teammates to do it. Excellent job by him picking off that last guy. And you can already see Sagu is moving on to the next point. God's trying to take out the trophy and the tacticals here. Barely wins his 1v1 somehow. Don't ask me because it shouldn't have made sense. Uh, he ended up getting flanked. He should hear him. He hears him. Makes the turn. Sees. And Esteban gets killed behind desk. And he's just trying to hold this last point. That spot on the desk is amazing to hold. So 
Kenny moves in, kind of wastes the opportunity there. That's okay, but we're still looking at Skipper trying to get some kills. You got Country moving in. Gets one, doesn't see the guy laying down the front door. He's about to get another one, but you can't shoot Jess through Jess apparently in this game. Kenny ends up losing his shot. And it looks like Esteban's just going to be watching here from the mid. Tries to make a push on the back of the floor desk. Get a whole lot. Gets one, drops the other. Jaden moves in, tries to get another one. We have the push from Country moving in here. Kenny just needs to look down on the ground. Gets the excellent drop, but we're at 12 seconds here. Zago should already be moving for the other point, just like King is. And you're going to have an Esteban versus King University right here if he sees it. Sees the head. Realizes he can shoot through. Oh, he's not able to get it. He's trying to get some help from Jaden here. He gets one. He gets two. Excellent job by Jaden to see the assist his teammate. And an excellent three-piece from him. Look, sees, and away, refire the door. If you have a big magazine, might as well, right? Excellent win by Sagu today. They did great. Thank you guys for being in the chat. I'm sorry I was so focused on this match. I don't know if I could commentate or not, so we were just chilling. Uh, is the game volume okay? Is, is my volume okay? Let me know. For those of you guys who are watching, let me know. Send it to the chat. Just be like, hey, turn the game down or, or turn you down. Uh, and we'll we'll adjust this. But look at this here. 14-22, 19-22, 45-22. And what damage is done by Jaden? And then 19 and 21. Excellent job by Sagu for, for performing so well. Um, that was a, a great way to start off your round, taking the one win. Right now, we are now be going to Search and Destroy. And Search and Destroy is really a token speciality for at least Skipper. Skipper is the man when it comes to it. I love playing with him for search. He's just phenomenal. He's got great game sense. And he understands, you know, hey, this is how the match should go. So um, we're going to see how he does, how well he does, and is leading his team in that. Um, Jaden probably is not going to be as much of a slay out. He can do well. Um, but we're going to embassy on search. So uh, Kyle, if you're in the chat, let me know. How does the sound sound? How is it all... How's it all going? Just because we want to make sure, you know, everything sounds good, is good, we're doing well. But, uh, yeah, so we're coming out here. Three, four, and we are, I think, ready to go on this next map. Um, and we're about to get game two going. Let me know if you guys have any clips or highlights that you saw, that anything that was cool. Jaden's three-piece was good. I'm trying to get all the action as it's happening, so I'm kind of just watching the mini-map and pressing buttons and hoping for the best. But, uh, you know, it's not bad for a, a pretty low-budget stream right here, from what I can say. So, <sighs> it's good for you guys to be in here. And uh... Oh, that's so sweet. Sarah, if you're watching, I saw that you wanted to get me canes, and I appreciate that. Anyways, we're going into Game 2, Search and Destroy on Embassy. This one should be interesting. So, I know the line, I know Purple has had some ideas about running a sniper. It's been somewhat successful. Um, with this team, I think we're going to go the first round and really just kind of see what happens. It's not really worth throwing out to have a sniper right off the bat. But we, oh, we do. Right here. Look at that thing. It's nice and gold and shiny, so everyone's going to see it if he's trying to be concealed with it. But we will see what happens. Game 2 starting in 4, 3, 2, 1. Let's get this match rolling. All right, so Sagu sending 3 to B. It looks like King's just going to go straight for a rush plant. They're kind of looking around, trying to see what they can get. Country seeing if he can get anything. Jaden gets one. Excellent job of the sniper. King is not on bar yet. Oh, but they do get Kung The Only one left is Country here. He's got to get onto Bomb. And honestly, he's probably going the smart route. I probably would have ran right through the middle, or at least through their embassy, just to see if I can get some kills from them in their spawn. But yeah, he's going to get peeked right here by the window. It's smart to just run away from that, take some shots, and go. Kyle, tell me about the sound! Tell me about the sound! Is game audio good? Is my vocal good like don't make me text you all right just pay attention to the stream that way i know you're here we're at, trying to clutch this 1v3 but i it's gonna be hard if you're turning and you're shooting you're gonna get shot by window get shot by, yep that's exactly what's gonna happen 
<sighs> Alright, Kyle, you're gonna get text now because you're just not paying attention. Okay, we'll turn the game audio down. Thank you, Steven. Someone cares about making sure the stream is productive. So I turned it down just a little bit, uh, maybe about a sixth. And it looks like, oh, we're going for a rush plan eight. King University all hiding at Xbox, though. This is pretty intense. What are they doing here? Brett loses his 1v1, and it looks like we're getting the plan off at A. And, ooh. Gods doesn't even know he's up top. Oh, he's looking. He's not ready, though. Nope. Gods loses his sniper matchup. This is the time where you're like, hey, you know, if we're not ready for it, we can't we can't just do it. So, uh, Skipper looks like he's watching up top from PD. And he loses his 1v1. Kenny, oh, caught timing. Gets pinched, and goodness, let's see it. Oh, hi, Aaron. I see you. Thank you, Steven, for telling me all these things. Um, King University. A good search and destroy team. Who who would have thunk it? Let me let me actually let's be smart about this, okay? If they're good, let's go see when they had that 3-1 loss, okay? What round did they win? Because that'll give us a little bit more information about, hey, is this school a search school? Because that's kind of how some schools can be. So let's go back to our guys here. It looks like we're still running with a sniper. Gods, and I, I don't know if you're going to really get that pick, you know? They already know that you're going. Get stunned. Brett, watching from here, he's on truck. He can't really see anyone or anything. It's kind of a useless spot, but he's not going to be able to see the guy up top. Oh, he sees him. He sees him. He doesn't get a kill, but he does get some damage off. Can he peek in middle? Looks the window. Gets the window. Oh, and he runs away from top paper. What an excellent move. Country's still trying to move out here. And Skipper knows someone's right here. Just bust through it. Bust through the door. Bust through the door. Gods ends up dropping. Skipper drops. Right now we just have Kenny. And... Brent gets one. This is now an even match. A nice little 2v2. Oh. How did Brent lose that? That's crazy. Okay, Kenny, he's... Oh, man. Oh, Kenny. No, no, no. Don't look that way. Don't do it. Don't look that way, Kenny. You got it. Yes. Now you defuse. Now you defuse. Don't chase him. Don't chase him. You don't chase him, Kenny. What's wrong with you? All right. Let's take a look at King University real quick. Excellent round by Sagu, but um, yeah, that one, that one is is tough. So King won a hard point, but lost search six to four, and lost control 03. So control might be the great equalizer here, but we'll find out. All right. So now we are round four. Is round four? Oh my gosh, round four. We're not doing too hot. But, uh, okay, round four. And I don't think that's a rush plant. I think they're doing something weird. They're trying to play as weird as possible. After staying back, trying to see if he can get a grenade. Oh, gets one hit marker. My man's just kind of hiding right behind that truck. God's got one pick. Oh, Kenny pushing. Doesn't see him sitting on the top. Jane ends up dropping that kill. Missed opportunity, but sometimes that's all you get. Skipper just kind of watching the mid. Seeing if he can find anyone running out. And they got two on B. So, Sagu really could do well with rolling around. Keeping King in a bad spot and watching this mid. Make the plant. And just see what they can do. It's actually really smart of uh, Skip to hold that spot. King is very patient right now, though. They didn't want to move at all. Looks like challenging up top is not the right option. Skipper's still staying to where he's at. God's trying to see if he can get anyone to pop up, but there's no takers of the bait. And it doesn't look like Estuan's going to be able to get anyone either. See, in the shadow, God gets one. Truck is there. Skipper didn't even know. Skipper pops steady. Seeing if he can get on the bomb. If he can get that one kill, that'll be amazing. 
Nope, he's not able to get there. King wins round four of Search and Destroy. <clears throat> I'm glad you like this commentary because it's completely biased to our team. And I'm not even caring about the other team and how they're doing. I am. I really am, actually. Naked does really good here. He's got a 7-0 KD. It's obviously going to be a lot, but it's nice to nice to sit here and just kind of be me and get hyped up about things. I think I have a lot invested in this, too. Granted, I'm the coach, so if I don't, we got problems. Okay, so we're moving on to round 5. Hopefully, Sagu can turn something around, but it's just not looking good. Put the sniper. Please, you don't have a sniper? You have an SMG? Okay, all is well in the world. All right, King looking like he'll do a rush blind at B. Esmon, the only one that's going to be able to see anything. He's going to try to... Uh, he doesn't want to look it. And he dies. Brett needs some help. You got a guy on top. He's not... Oh, what a grenade. What an explosion. Way to shoot it. Jaden ends up getting one kill. I didn't watch it, so I'm sorry. But now that he's got a Vaznet... Things are a little different here. Espawn's watching top. Doesn't have any idea. It's probably because Jaden's calling it out. Bomb is right below him. If he just peeks, like, oh, oh my goodness. You're right on top of him. Oh, he just popped Eddie. He's just standing there. Jaden ends up getting one. Wasn't paying attention to that one either. There's another one. This should be an easy cleanup as long as Jaden sits there and understands that stairs. Yep. Excellent round by Sagu. Way to be patient. Try not to... <laughs> the rest of Kenny was... <laughs> I was roasting everyone. I'm very confident in Jade's 1v1s, but if he's caught off guard, it's just... That's a big piece that's cut out for Sagu, so... I'm glad he's able to get some 1v1s as long as he has a clear path and he starts, you know, winning. He's able to start doing some, some good work. <sighs> ah! I would recommend Sagu to Rush Plant B. That's my recommendation. They don't have to listen to it. In fact, oh, they're listening to it. Okay, God's is gonna watch here because he knows they. Oh my goodness, this is a big old. Watch. There's one. Don't peek. Don't peek. Don't peek. Oh, you just lost your life. Brick got another one back here. He might get one more. Oh, he's laying down. Oh, okay. Sagu just hold an objective. Why? Why move? Skipper gonna take that back corner. Get off my American flag. You move forward. Move forward. How dare you? Oh, he doesn't have a trophy. He gotta get inside. He ain't making it. And there goes one. Sagu now on a 1v2, and they know where Kenny is at. Kenny has to reposition here or hold the best that he can because right now, you're gonna make a lot of noise and just try to get him scared. So get in an angle where you can see bomb. Do something. Yeah, you don't, you can't just peek it. That's just a frustrating loss, but it is what it is. King is playing very well. I think if Sagu gets the chance to attack again, they just need to rush and take Xbox. Like, have liners, snipers lined up on Xbox. Watch that hallway, because they made a four-man push. There. Look at those kills here. Four and four, ten and one. Naked is just going to town on the team. He's done zero damage though, so we're questioning that for sure. Anyways, back to the real game. We'll be watching there. Let's see. Nicky's end up with a good team pick, and he's gonna get another one. Oh, it's below him. Kenny gets one. This might be a good defense round. Esteban not even moving. Just it's like, hey, we'll take that. Country loses a one on one. Yeah, I'd call the rotate to A here, boys. Wow. Jaden just going to kills. Skipper loses one. Kenny's the next pusher. Gotta know that his footsteps are making some noise. You can't just hide that way. Gods is looking. I don't even know. Would you climb ladder and double push it? It's a scary thought. You could just stay there. I try not to get the other perspective, but I'd love to see what Naked is looking at right now. Oh, 
Can he gets one hit marker, he's not able to get the full kill. Yeah, I would expect a plant on B. Just like that. He's got a plant, he's got a plant. You gotta know these planting. Oh, that's a good 1v1. What a to clutch up by Jaden. Wow. Good round. Here, Here is the point where it's like, why are you commentating the match and not coaching? Because then you'd be like, hey, go run the sniper to mid. My guys aren't watching the stream. We're not like that. <sighs> but this is where you put Jaden on sniper, put him in mid, and send two ARs mid, and you just duke it out. You drop one so they have less firepower than you focus the other two with ARs. Hopefully Country gets the idea he's not running around the side, but I think he wants to make a big play. He's already looking there. And it looks like we're going to have a rush plane on B. King not making the same layout that they did last time, though. Esteban gets one. I didn't see that coming. So Jaden's trying to hunt down the other King member. Kind of knows that he's right there. Oh. Oh, that's dangerous. Don't run out. Don't do it. All right, you're good. Thank you. Okay, Kenny kind of watching the corner, making sure nobody comes out, nothing happens. One more down by Jaden, because I keep switching on the wrong times. Oh, he just runs by him. Oh, Kenny wins a 1v1. And he's right below country. They just have no idea. They're just chilling. That's what I'm going to watch now. Loses his. Country, watch the stairs. Ah! That's okay. That's still a round win. Oh, way to get the kill. Sagu. Hanging on by a thread. Trying to make a sweep. First sweep, but I don't know if we're going to get that. Back to running it. Two Titans on either team, helping their teams to carry it out to victory. We're gonna see what Sagu does. King making a rush plan at B. Sagu sent it a different layout this time. Country's still watching. Kenny watching. Oh, Kenny is not able to see what's coming his way. Watch that ladder. Oh, he's caught throwing nades. Skipper gets out with his life, just barely. <sighs> Looks like King should be making that plant, but I don't know what's Keeping him there. We got one down. Kenny, I think you should hold that head peak, but you ain't going. You're just going to keep walking forward. All right. I trust you. Don't break my trust. King has a pretty unique way out. They're watching up top. They're watching back. They're not really, like, covering everything. Does that make sense? Like, they have people in position, sure, but they're not watching everything. Kenny, oh. Gets a sneak up. Gets one. Bomb's planted. Spawn has a 1v1. Oh, can he die too? No. What do you mean the Lions have you stressed? What's going on in the Lions stream? Let's, let's watch that for a second on my phone. So, Myra, what are we looking at? We're on another hard point already? Oh, it's a replay. Unlock that. Set you sideways. Ooh, we got a we got a three piece. We're we running three SMGs right now. Our lions one one two. We're 1-1. One, one. I'm confident in control. What happened to Lions? Someone tell me. All I'm seeing is replays. I'm not seeing anything.
That was just the first round. <laughs> they, they won't be like Rocket League Lions. There are any three, four. Ah! That's brutal. Oh, shoot. I need to change my... You guys hear any of that stream back background? They started late. Yeah, there was some server problems. It was pretty weird. I didn't like it. Um, we couldn't set up a free for all because the teams were unbalanced. Riddle me that one, Batman. Yeah, I don't know. Don't know about it. Um. I just want to know the score. Did Lions win or win we game or no? They're 0 1. Hardpoint is first map, so do they lose hardpoint? We have a connection issue with one of King Universities. They have to reset. I think that's. There's only eight people here. There needs to be nine. I mean, we're on Codcaster, but how good is my KBM aim? We'll find out right now. It's terrible, actually. So, oh, hold on. Wait a second. Aha! There we go. Okay. Reload here. Press the R button. That's weird. Yeah, I don't ever want to hear a PC player complain about aim assist. This is too easy. Yeah, this is way too easy. Try me out on the Valtor. Maybe not. Don't, don't ever. Don't. Don't try me out on the belt. Still waiting. Am I in trouble? Nope, we're still waiting. Alrighty then. Do you guys have any questions? Anything about Sega Wii Sports? About what we're doing this week? Um, got campus days next week. Questions about my job. I started a new job at admissions. That's pretty nice. Um, we can talk about the Instagram Live that we did. That was fun. They asked me what my favorite non-competitive game was, and I told them Destiny 2. And they asked me, why did I like it? You want to know what my answer was? It was that I was competitive in it. And I liked the competitive aspect. So that was nice. <sighs> I'm trash at trials, though. I need to get carried. Where's Asher? Asher needs to carry me in trials. What all is going to happen at Campus Days for Esports? So, Thursday, I wake up, sell my soul to admissions. Right? We go, Kyle is going to be in charge of handling a lot of the stuff for Campus Days. So, Crazy Kyle 414 and Watto are going to head up a lot of the setting up and production. We don't, we're not going to have any practices. So I'm going to announce that in the admin meeting. So, surprise, surprise. There you go. Uh, I was waiting for your lobby to become joinable. Oh, our lobby is not joinable. There we go. Um, What was I saying? 
Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So we're going to have 2v2 Call of Duty, and we'll have it on Xbox and PlayStation just for the people that are not, you know, just better and play Xbox. So for the PlayStation crippled people, we'll let them play, and um, they'll be able to do that. And so we'll have uh, 2v2s on there. That should be good. And then we're also going to have a Smash set up, at least two of those. We'll have Wii Sports, or Switch Sports. Sorry, not Wii Sports. Got you guys excited. Switch Sports. And we'll have Super Mario Strikers, and we will also have, um, they can add another one. Oh, we'll have Mario Kart. So, yeah, no practice Thursday. Big, big fail by me, but oh well, here we are. We'll live. So let's get into this control match. So the idea behind this is that you're going to want to defend two sites. Um, and it's just kind of like a zone, like, just cut out in space. So we'll see... What happens? Looks like King is starting to make a push right off of B. This is probably the harder one to take, but it's much easier when it's secure. So if you get the first win on it, it's kind of just a little bit better overall. King dropping one. Country trying to reload, and he's still holding the zone. Doesn't see the guy up top. Oh, excellent job. Way to clear it. Yeah, get that trophy down. You don't need to reload if you just shot five bullets. It's okay. Kenny, the only one trying to hold here on his own. Jaden comes in, helps him with the assist. Kenny about to get shot in the back. Isn't seeing it. Jaden gets him. Wow. Wow, what a shot. Skipper. Holding off B on his own against a whole team of Tornadoes. King trying to see what they can do. See how I use their actual like team name because it's... Yeah, I went there. So anyways, trying to see what they can do. Ah, doesn't see top bedroom. He's not able to finish it. Kenny gets one. Seeing if he can make a push. Oh, everyone's a little indecisive as to what they want to do. So far, the stock count looking very good for Sagu, and King is not making a push on any of this. They're not able to get on point, not able to make any effective moves here. Looks like God's is waiting for him. Coming out of fridge, gets one. Not looking. Oh, gets saved by the man, a big country. And what a move by him. Try to pick up a weapon here, gets a scar. Is that a suppressor? Nope, that's just a muzzle. Country facing three people, trying to just keep him off point. He does it. What a move. Sagu takes this control 1-0. Oh, my goodness. What a play, boys. I'm so excited. Look at this. They're all coming. You had to just stop him from getting past that line. He was ready. Oh, man. What a boy. All right, so Sagu's got to attack now. So, if you're attacking... Sending 3 to A and 1 to B is pretty okay because you're kind of like, hey, we're at B, haha. <laughs> no, you're really at A and you're taking it. So I think King has an idea about they're going to want to defend A. Yeah. So we split up evenly here. I'm sending 2 to A. Skipper trying to get 1. Throws a nade, ends up losing his gunfight. Oh, but they are able to clear. Put Sagu in a good position. Kenny, they're trying to get the three stack on there. Skipper holding off on his own. Sagu able to take A. They're about to control this zone and move on to B. Give themselves a high five, a pat on the back, and do excellent stuff. All right. God's moving on. Gets killed by reception. That's a hard fight to win, so I'm not really going to say anything about it. That's just kind of a difficult one. Oop. Gets hit in the face with a grenade. Not able to do anything with it. He's like, he's still trying to find a way to get around to be. That's the hard part. Is once you take a spot, it's kind of like everyone's going to be here, so you have to start winning every gunfight that you get. God's committing war crimes, about to kill the enemy with the weapon of his enemy. Seeing if you can get a long shot, but it's kind of too far. Kenny's already on point. Looking to see what he can do. He's getting shot in the back. Country not able to get a hold down. It looks like Scott is the last man standing. Barely saw Kappa Carlin right there, but it's a good, good, okay win. And 
me see if you can get a look on someone. He's one on the outside. Tries to get the jump shot. Not able to. We just got two boys hiding behind a box here. Zagu holding it down. Able to get the, the hold, but it looks like, oh no, someone's coming from the mid. Can he watch a mid, seeing what he can get? Loses to man. Oh, but we have a firing squad looking mid right now. Sagu is not letting anyone go. What a win. Two caps, two defends, one more defend to go, and Sagu is able to take this game three and move it to hard point. Now, here's the crazy thing, okay? Control, control is the only one in the set. There's only one control, and it's it's game three. Search and destroy is game two, and it's game five. Hard point is game one and game four. I do not want to see these guys go to game five. I think King, if they have the mental fortitude, will win game five. So Sagu needs to win control here and then win the next hard point. And they did hard point pretty okay, but it was a little rough at first. So I think if they just got the rotations down and they're able to win their gunfights, this shouldn't be a problem. King looking like they're going to do a full push at A. Everyone trying to get in on this action. As a one-man defense ends up dropping here. Looks like we're going to see Kenny coming up. Or Country, I'm sorry, excuse me. Try to see if he can see someone, but... Oh, he's late on the reaction time. Oh, it looks like King has a firm hold on this. Kenny just understanding, hey, we're not taking this. Let's just run back, regroup, and get all of our efforts consolidated into one focus. So watching desk is going to be good, and, and or watching from desk to couches. That's a smart play. Looks like one member from King's going to just move right in there. That's an okay win. Perception. Oh, Kenny loses his gunfight there. That's a little scary. Country. Ooh. Throwing grenades when other people are looking. We have a little Mexican standoff right here. God's waiting for one of King to come in. Oh, he ended up getting him. Skipping the last man off point. Not able to win his gunfight either. Everyone running from jewelry. This is terrible news for Segu. You don't want to be at this point. Nope, just let him go. Skipper not able to get anyone. Nobody's able to get it. That's going to be a round win for King University. Wow. Well executed. Way to, way to go by the tornadoes. What a shot! What is this? Is this going to peak? To each their own. I just watched Ogden get a pistol kill on Search and Destroy. He climbed up ladder at Embassy, and just looked, and just nailed him. And then he loses a gunfight! Oh my gosh. Okay, we're not talking about Lions. Right now we are back in. Purple moving to take B. We got two members of King already sitting there trying to watch. Jaden drops one, trying to get the pick on the other one. Gets number two! Oh, this might be a really good hold for Sagu. They're watching mid. Country loses his gunfight. Kenny's sitting there, got the biggest magazine in the world, trying to see what he can do. But couches is going to be clear. That's two ticks for Sagu. Just need a few seconds more, but they're not watching. Kenny gets one. Need to watch from the backside. Nobody's there. Country can't see him. Country gets him. Oh, we already got B. We are now moving on to A. Bigger and better things ahead for SAGU Purple. Oh, way to watch it. I think he was just trying to pick the gun up, but whatever it was, saved your life. Country lives one. We gotta watch him get two? Nope, we're not. Alright, Sagu Purple now taking control of point A. So you gotta watch from carpet on both sides. You gotta be sure that you're watching jewelry. So we got the carpet. Who's watching? Nobody's watching jewelry. Oh man, that's terrible news. There you go. We got one coming in from the back. All of Sagu is gone. A team wipe by King, but there's already two ticks and two minutes left to play on this point. Seeing if he could try to make a move here. Jaden getting one pick. Skipper still on his own. Oh, but Jaden's going to be pushing in. Dead silence. Nobody's going to know he's here. He gets one. He gets two. We just need all these ticks right here. You got to watch Carpet. You got to make sure you win that gunfight. He loses. We got one. Oh, we're halfway there. Living on a prayer. Four stack. Zagu wins game three. Let's go, boys. We're moving on to game four with the advantage and a hard point on Embassy. If you guys aren't as hyped as I am, I don't know what to do about it.
don't know what I can help you with because these are insane good games. That's a good win. And he just, boom, boom. Yep. Excellent play. Sagu Lions currently updating. We are on search and destroy on Embassy, and it is two to one in Sagu's favor. And they are, they are going to town right here. Make sure that I change my deal once I can. That way we're not waiting on me. Boom. Pow. Pop. Yeah, this hard point's a big one. And it, it, it is winnable, sure. You know, we want it to be winnable. We want it to be that thing. Um, we got to hope for the best. That's really, that's really what it is. And, uh... You know, hope the rotations are good. Hope they understand where people are going to be. Embassy is a tough one, but they've run it so much to where it's it's one that's confidently can be in their, their favor. So if they're early and they're winning gunfights, that's all they need to do. I think, and it's not even really just winning like every gunfight. It's just the initial ones. Just win the ones that you need to win first. If you win the important one, then everything else will be fine. Oh, we got Phil in a 1v2 on search. Oh, no way, Phil. No way you do. Oh, he lost it. He was so close. We're going to take a slight break for me to drink a Gatorade. And I'm going to mute that so you guys aren't here all the slurpy. Because um, I hate that sound. But we are getting loaded into hardpoint. Let's go. Game 4. Sagu match point seeing if they can take it. Four, three, two, one. Let's get this bread. Sagu, moving on, starting off um, on the P5 side. I think that's P5. Let's see if they can get any points in here. We are already on point, but we do not have the spawns for the next. So what we're focusing on is we want to get spawns for P5. So you're going to see that, hey, holding points, good. Keeping them off is good. But we're really wanting to see right here. This play is what's going to make or break the match just misses him. Misses him, doesn't look, and he's getting shot in the back because of it. So we want to have the spawns where number four is just spawned. So <clears throat> it's going to be in the bottom right corner. That's where Sagu wants to be. Winning this is going to be okay. Oh, he just stopped firing. But Sagu's now spawned everywhere around and about, and they're not going to have a uh, cohesive push on this. Skipper a little scared to move on to the next point. I would be too. You gotta pick the guy. That's a good win. Moves out, makes a push. Not able to get the second one. Country just watching laundry room for whatever reason. Okay, he's just gonna stand there. Just stand away. One. That's two. Oh, and he dies by a trophy system. Kenny losing a 1v2. That's okay though. That's not one you would expect to win. Sagu trying to retake point here while King is just taking the lead. By Skipper. Country not able to win any of his matchups. You see Skipper here going for the early rotation. King is trying to make the same play, but they're going to have to go up the ladder. So Skip's going to have to just wait, not peek it. Just, you know, hold button the best. Not able to get his. Kenny sitting back. Oh, that was a uh, Country, excuse me. And, uh,. We do have someone on point. Gods is, is soaking up points. So this puts Sagu in advantage for points, but not an advantage for position. So Skipper trying to make something happen. And he gets one. 
Jumps onto point. It almost gets two. And you're just trying to nade out from here. Destroy that trophy system and see if you can make something happen. But Red's going to be running too far, too fast. Tactical sprint down to get him. Oh, Esteban, that's an okay position. He's head peeking. He doesn't know, though. King is just holding Sagu up in the middle. Just see if we can get the point. Oh, man. Kenny able to get seen by the head peek. That is just such a good position. Red just waiting. Seeing if he can get something. Gets distracted by the trophy. Ends up winning one. Loses the other. But we are now moving on to the point or position for point three. So King making an excellent work of points one, two, or at least two and three. Point one was a little in Sagu's favor. But Sagu now owns point four. This is their house. They're not going to let anyone get in. And you guys are going to get mad because my podcasting here is not going to help. <laughs> it's going to be a, a big rush and everyone's going to die from every angle. That's just how this room works. So we're going to see if we can see what's going on. There's a full team wipe by Sagu. Excellent job. That's good points. Let's see someone coming in from the side. There was a nade. I think that stuck behind the corner. Oh man, this is a big old Mexican standoff. Nobody wants to push. They're all waiting. King pushes. One down. Oh, Country kills his own teammate. Or at least helps in it. And everyone is wiped. Oh my goodness, what a push and a move by King. That is an excellent play, but Sagu is going to start moving on to this next point. Skipper gets shot in the back. Country is going to get his revenge and be able to avenge his brother. But we are looking at, oh, Sagu got a pretty okay spawn too. But Country's getting a three on two or a two on one right now. Sagu able to make some momentum push on it. Skipper going to watch and try to get the guy here. Excellent move. We just got to hold red room and we should be okay. So you're going to want to watch laundry. And laundry dies, you're going to have to watch orange. Country now the last man on point. About to have a 1v1 against red room. Red room's going to run in. Oh, he loses it. Skipper loses in the middle. And he's trying to hold. There's one. Oh, Kenny gets knifed by King. Not the best sight to see. Uh, Espon getting shot in the back, trying to make him push on a P1. All right, Sega loses top AC, loses pretty much advantage over every spot in the map. Red trying to stay on, gets one. And Sagu honestly should start making the push right now for P2. And it looks like Gods is going to be doing that. Somehow avoids whoever was in the building, but. King making some good use of their time here, but Sagu did catch up on points on the last two hills, so. Uh, Sagu's probably going to get the advantage here on the next one. If Jaden can stay alive. If he could just stay physically alive. Oh, what a beat. Excellent headshot. He's getting pushed from every angle here and is just able to win at all times. Esteban winning another face off here. King trying to push through the building. He's not going to get a good lineup. Gods has every gun in the book and he is good with all of them. Kenny trying to hold a long angle with his SMG here. Kind of wouldn't recommend it. Let's see what happens. Gods gets a 1v1 through the wall. Esteban trying to hold. Kenny loses on the outside. Skipper trying to make his push to the next one. <laughs> gets met by two members of King. Kenny gets one. He's going to look for number two right here. Oh, number two went to Milk. He didn't go to that same side. So Espon spawns far side, loses his 1v1. Kenny is now the guy that needs to hold this next point. And it looks like King is already here. They're going to get him as soon as he comes out the door. Yep, just right there. And you're going to want to watch up top. See, a good idea is to move your players onto... Uh, 
upstairs PD. So right here, right where country's going. That's a good overwatch angle. If you're able to get that guy who's going to stand up, and then you're going to want to push for milk, but Zagu doesn't have the min power to do it. So okay, he's kind of just going to have to watch out. Someone has a threat. I don't know who that is. Oh, God did. End up getting a team kill. Trophy saved. All of King University, but this is okay to a point. Right now, you're kind of just seeing if you can chip at the armor and if you can get any cracks. But if you can't get a crack, then uh, you just got to kind of move on to the next one. Did we get two? Almost gets all of them. Hunter seeing if he can make a difference here. Oh, loses just by the jump shot. And Kenny gets flanked. Look at the after. Tries to pre-fire, doesn't get anything. Sagu is just out of position and blocked from the next hill entirely. King already has two members on it. They're holding old, and they're they're utilizing every bit of space that they can. Skipper's going to try to come in from the top side here. Kenny breaking in from the side. Finds one member that's laying down. Brett might be able to come in to make a difference. Doesn't see one. He loses his face off to the other one. King may be able to win off this hill if they hold it. Sagu needs to start winning every gunfight that they find themselves in. Jaden loses right there at the door. It's a hard place to push. You don't want to challenge him. He gets one. Brett's going to move in. He's got to get on the hill. He's got to get a touch. He's got to do something. This King is just letting it. He's just holding it. Kenny gets one. This is now a Sagu contested hill. He gets two. Send a penny. He gets shot in the back. King. Looks like they're going to take it. Sagu's not going to have enough time to get in and actually touch it by making a cohesive push. So. Three seconds and King University takes game three. Kenny jumps on the hill, contests it. He wins one. Skipper's here. He loses. And King wins game four. Wow. What a round. Give me one second. That was really exciting, so I gotta I gotta hold myself to, to relax. It looks like Elmira Purple just won a 6-5 search destroy against the Lions. Oh, and we go to game five. The all or nothing, the decision maker, the, the title changer for all things involving Search and Destroy. Sagu did not win their first round with it. So it's safe to say that King feels they have an advantage with this. They just won round three or round four. four. So right now we're wondering, hey, you know, who's going to be that guy that picks it up? Who's going to be the one that wants it more? And hopefully it's Sagu because, you know, that's my school. But King University has the manpower. They have the skill. I think they're turning up, and it's it's a little scary to see. So Sagu getting all three of their wins on Hotel, all two of their wins. Sorry, I was trying to predict the future. Losing twice at Embassy, okay? So this should be the map, but we got to make sure the map and the mode are in sync with each other. So um, recommend no sniper play today. <laughs> <laughs> not on not on this one unless unless really you're defending then you're going to want to be able to get um heady on p4 uh for hotel but we're going to see how it goes and how it works oh, i went in that room and it was dead quiet you could hear a pin drop both teams are kind of just sitting there silent because they both lost but this is the nature of the game it's the animal we got to face and and you know, we choose to go in and fight lions, then, hey, we're choosing to fight a lion in a pit on a snowy day. You know, it's we're not just choosing one. We're choosing we're choosing any day. Okay, we don't just get to pick the animal that we fight on one day. We fight that animal again and again until we have conquered it and we have achieved victory. 
and our victory comes through Christ. So we're taking it, we're taking the wins, and we're taking the, the heart that we can have with all this. Why does it say that Sagu Lions are four and two on our main street? I'm pretty sure we're four and three. That's, yeah, we're five and two. I think it's probably a typo. If you're in the chat, let me know. Let me know if you're still here. I'm talking. And I'm trying to do things. And uh, we're going to need some support. So if you guys got it, rally it in the chat. Let's have a go, go purple on here. I'll even type it in myself just to be that, that leader that my mom wanted me to be. Oh, it's got it. Wants me to log into the Twitch. I'm streaming on Twitch. What do you mean log in? I am that guy. Okay, let's try this. Audio just went lower. Can you confirm? All right, my chat just reloaded. So if, if uh, anyone said anything, um, well, now I can't see it. So, yeah, yes. No, get me out of here. I don't want to see that. I think it was probably my mic was further away from my face than what it was before because I took a drink again. There we go. See, said I'd start it. You guys finish it. There we go. See, I know how to do things. Sagu Lions are on control right now. They are... Are they defending? They're attacking. They've already taken A. They're working on taking B. And... Looks pretty even right now, kill-wise. But I think... Territory-wise, Sagu is holding a little better. Sagu does have two ticks on B. Oh. Oh. Oh, it looks like there might be a reason for doing something here. Sagu just threw grenades at the ground to kill themselves. But I don't know what that was. Okay, well, I'm confused. Apparently, that's a thing that we're going to do. Um, we are waiting on someone to reset. I believe it is Kenny. Kenny has some connectivity issues with um, Call of Duty. Sometimes it gives him a white screen like he's been flashbang. So <clears throat> that's kind of one of those things. Sagu Lions did win round one of control. Looks like they are relieved. That would actually be their first game win if they took control. So... Um, could be a reverse 3-0. That's a difficult thing to do. But I know that... Um, I didn't get to see a hard point, but I know Surge was close. It was very close. So it was one of those games where it was like, ah! But we will see. Ugh. We are starting round two of Control. And I'm just narrating to you guys, so I hope you like it. Um... Uh... 
they put sagu in black on the highlighted colors so i have no idea what's going on here it's like black and gold because they tried to make it yellow and they made elmira white so i'm just i'm confused because elmira is purple too there we go pineapple fanta is back ya boy is here and we're getting ready to get started here skipper he just needs to change his assignment and we will be okay Sorry if you guys are hearing me sniff. Sagu Lions um, holding Elmira at each point, trying to maintain control, but it looks like they're taking B on Hotel. That's two ticks. Oh, they're just going to take A. They're going to own A. Wow. Wow, what a clear. They're doing great. Anyways, we're back to the real game. Yeah, it is crazy over there, man. I feel like the gameplay is just so much faster. You guys are lucky you're not just getting a map view. LOL. Okay. Um, we don't want to see the other team. Because I don't want to see what they're doing. I want to just see our guys. All right. Lions making a push to defend A. Looks like King is going for a rush plant. A little slow. Honestly. Oh, my goodness. Jaden getting one snipe. I didn't even look at that. He's running it. And he's running it well. He's another one. Misses his shot. Oh, okay. So, Sagu is bombed down. That's a good thing. But you got to watch out about hey. Make sure your backside's covered. Make sure you're not opening yourself up to anything. And really, Kenny, if you're defending, you don't want to go push. But you're going to go do it anyway. So, uh, you know, I hope you do well. Live long and prosper, my brother. Just trying to watch mid. Oh. Oh, cod timing. He sees the gun. He's waiting. He gets the shot. What an angle. Kenny was looking to check B. Nobody's there. He's kind of just out here looking around. Being a little paranoid. LOL. And... Zagu waiting. Oh, he's on the ladder. Skipper having to turn around. Gets the shot. Zagu wins 1-0 on this search and destroy. Way to take it. They are moving on for this next round. And Lions currently are... Winning 11... 10-6 in lives. They might lose B here in a second. They actually might time Elmira out. Ooh, our boys are cracked. That's all I gotta say. Yeah, they just won round two of control. No, the team has only two lives left. Zagu is starting their second round of Search and Destroy. I think we're gonna go with the Rush Plant here. This should be a straight sprint. No, you don't even need to throw that nade. Oh, you just grab bomb and you're sniping. You're crazy. Ooh, he raids it! Oh, he's not looking down! Oh, he sees him! I am man, not knowing what he's going to do to get out of this situation. Country! Oh, seeing on balcony! Loses his gunfight, though. Kenny, sitting in Sarah's apartment. Loses his gunfight as well. That's just an unfortunate loss. It's now two against three. And you got to watch out because number four is creeping around the backside. Jaden is about to run right into him. Just Esteban against the world. Fortunately, the world beat him. Sagu did end up winning round two, so now we are on round three of control. Jimmy is so good. He's ridiculous. Boy, he doesn't miss. I know. I really should just be watching Jaden. But because he's using a sniper, I don't want him to get the credit. That sounds terrible, right? Okay, King making a push to B right off the bat. You can see their team starting to move up to the top side. This means that Country is going to get a lot of information for this team right here. 
He's going to sit and just listen. He's going to hear and wait. And I think at this point, Lions or Purple has to understand that, hey, they're moving B. This is where you just sit and hear voices and feet. Get a yep, 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 yep. All coming to Kenny. Kenny is a one-man army right now. He's the only thing standing between King to plant and not. Wait a second. Is he crossing? Wreck gets bombed. That's an excellent win by him. Kenny, or Skipper, sitting in the back watching. Oh, and King's trying to scramble. They don't know what they're doing right here. Oh, Skipper loses his gunfight. Doesn't matter if he got a sniper. It is now a 2v1. Sagu's favor. Brett's just kind of got to wait. They already know where... Oh, they didn't... I probably didn't even look at bomb. They should know where bomb is. You swear you... Nope. Nope, turn! Oh, Jaden picked up the AR. That's going to be a good win. One to two to one. Sagu's favor. Update online. Sagu is down in, in lives, but they are almost finished capturing the last base on their control match. I keep seeing our guys Semtex into the ground and just kill themselves. I don't know what that's about. That's weird. I don't like that. Anyways, please someone else besides Jaden grab the bomb. Can he grab bomb? He should be the rush blank guy. He should be jumping right on this mug. No stopping. You can't stop when you're doing it. Jaden currently trying to give Sagu some overwatch. He's starting to look window. And he's not seeing anyone where he wants him to be. Sagu getting to the plant. Seeing if they can get anything off here. Oh! Kill by country at couches. What a move. Jaden gets a snipe here. This puts King in a awful position. Like, absolutely awful. You don't want to be here with two guys coming in from the opposite side on a, a disadvantage. But yeah, I guess it doesn't matter if you win gunfights. Jaden's going to be looking couches here, waiting for him to peek. Oh, he missed his opportunity. He's just got to wait. He's just got to wait. Kenny gets one. He gets one. Waiting on the other. Oh, what a pre-fire. He still doesn't get him. Skip was just watching bomb. Ooh, excellent round win. And uh, I'm looking at Lions. I didn't get to see the end of theirs. I feel like they would have won, but they were down live, so it may not have been the case. Sagu up 3-1 against King in this last, last game. Excellent job by Jaden for getting his snipes. Those are actually coming in clutch. That's at least one, three. Out of six, he's probably got four sniper shots. So that's really good on his part. He's doing good work with sniper. Oh, Lions did win. They're going to game four, boys. In Lady. Skipper watching here. Seeing what King's going to do. King making an awkward play. Standing kind of just in the center by reception. I don't know if I would advise that to anyone. That just doesn't sound fun to me. But they're trying to avoid the sniper, and so I feel like this is an okay position. Brett gets one. He needs to get out of there. Gets out. Oh, he's got someone charging. And he's stunned. Brett needs him, but he ends up dying in the process. Wow. Wow. Clutch, speaking of clenched things, like, my entire body. We just killed the entire team in, like, three seconds. <laughs> that's that's crazy. I only got to catch two of them. Wow. Four to one in Sagu's favor. This could be really, really good for them if they secure this last round. Kenny, if he makes the sprint, should be able to get there, but he's not going for the full sprint on bomb. He's going to put himself in a weird position, then he's going to plant. Jaden already gets one. I still don't know why I'm not streaming him instead of someone else. Skipper trying to get shot at couches. It's not working, and it looks like Kenny ended up getting over in uh, kitchen. All right. Let's give Kenny up top. Okay. Got to hear the guy coming in behind him. Three fires. That's why you don't use the hurricane, Kenny. You gotta use a stronger gun. 
already know someone's coming to reception. Hurts him. Doesn't get the final kill. It does get stunned. Oh, this guy's going to peek and lose. Oh, s Punk gets flanked. Jaden's got to win with a pistol. He gets one. There's no way he gets two. He's got to reload. He's just got to stay alive for a few seconds. That's a round win for Sagu. Excellent job by Kenny for planning. Jaden finishes it off. Oh my goodness, this is wild. Sagu looking like Search and Destroy was the thing that they were made for. <laughs> I don't even know. I don't even know. You put a guy with a pistol and a sniper, he gets one kill and then he picks up an AR. Dude, your game is over. You got the most accurate man shooting a rifle that you can. Good. Ness. Jaden 10 and 3 right now. Skipper 4 and 3. Country 4 and 6. But he does have some good plays. And he kind of starts off the round for the team. And Kenny 3 and 4 as well. So I'm just going to watch. I'm going to watch Jaden. Okay. Looks like Sagu's going to get able, be able to get push here. Nobody's peeking yet. Oh, a little late. King already knows that there's a sniper. Look at right here. He's looking around, gets shot in the back. Esteban ran around the whole side, gets one. He's starting to move, make a push on two of them. Esteban loses his face off. God's trying to get a snipe on, just doesn't seem to locate where King is at. Oh, sees one head. It's gonna make a to shoot through. He shoots through the desk, gets one. Oh, and it is a 1v1 right now. Kenny versus I am man. Stunned, but he is not out for sure. Gets an opposing stun on I am man, but the bomb is away from man. He can't make the push and and do it well. Can he have any advantage here? Seeing if he can try to flank around and just watch any movement that's going to happen. Loses the 1v1. Oh my goodness. Kenny, you did not just start the reverse sweep. We're not having that. Sagu now has a chance to do the attack. If they get the plan off like they did last time and just hold King at bay, this should be a good win. Excellent play by Iron Man. Way to turn on it. <sighs> man, I'm going to slap Kenny. I'm not going to slap Kenny. Kenny's too sweet, man. He's a he's a sweetheart. But I'm going to tell him to never use that gun ever again. He needs to use the Fasnav. He's losing too many gun fights. All right. <sighs> Sagu going in for the next round. Kenny again going to make the rush plant. Country's still going to just hold him off at B. And we'll switch to gods just to see if he's able to see someone. But I don't think he is from where he's at. Rhett loses his 1v1. King just has no idea that Sagu goes for A every time. You got five people looking in the same direction for Sagu. Oh, <laughs> and each team just doesn't have an idea about where they're at. Jane's starting to get an idea. Looking around. Oh, see some movement. And a hit marker ends round three. He should get this defused without any problems. And we're moving on to round nine. Sagu line or purple still at match point. We're still at this point where we gotta have something happen. Gotta gotta get that little tip over the edge. And I think I think they should be able to get it if King honestly if King goes A, Sagu should be able to get it, because they'll be able to lock it down. It looks like that's what's gonna happen here. Did they drop bomb? Did I just see him drop bomb? I'm so confused. I've never seen that in my life. Man, we're up. It's a 1v3 on King. Sagu just has to get a peek. And that is it. Kenny, finally with the Hurricane, wins it for the Sagu. They move on to playoffs. Mark that down on your calendar, boys. These teams are moving on to bigger things. Excellent job by King University. It's another Christian school. Um, very respectable. You guys did awesome. Appreciate you. Um... 
Reels GG's. You guys did great. So awesome. Excellent job. Uh, appreciate you guys watching the stream. We will close it out here and let you guys get some sleep as I as well get sleep. Have a blessed night.